hello, it's Dr. Shelly with Shelly's Nursing Review. And once again, I'm hooking a sister and a brother up, okay? Because I'm trying to make you to nurse with the purse and hang with the bank. What am I doing? I'm preparing you for nursing school. Yeah, it's coming to a theater near you. Let's go, chop, chop, boom. Now, whether you're going to nursing school or you're taking an NCLEX exam, I got you today, okay? Mm -hmm. Here we go, we got labs. Now you gotta stay focused, okay? Cause nursing school is hard. They charge you all that money and for what? They make you teach yourself. So I'm your little coach, okay? I'm your NCLEX coach. Here we go. Miss Piggy and Kermit came home on cloud nine. Now, sounds like a porn flick. I get it. You're not thinking dirty. You're trying to stay with me. Stay focused on nursing school. Here's what I'm trying to tell you. The first letter of all these words, the M for Miss, the P for Piggy, the K for Kermit, the C for Came, the H for Home, the O for On, the C for Cloud, the N for Nine. All of these letters are the first letters of electrolytes or labs that you better know. So I got an easy way of figuring it out. First of all, until I see you again, Wait a minute, hold, hold up. Did you hit that subscribe button? Okay, just checking. Before I see you again, I bet you better know that the first letter of all of these words make up electrolytes here in the list, but that doesn't help you on a test if you don't have it ingrained in your mind that Miss Piggy and Kermit came home on cloud nine. Something that's gonna help you is the word nine. You have nine labs, one for magnesium, two, for phosphorus. Guess what? This thing right here, one, two, what the hell's that? That's the and sign. Don't be dingy, okay? That ain't nothing. Number three ain't nothing. I told you you had nine labs where number three ain't nothing. So let's start over because I know you, I lost you somewhere between ADHD and ADD and all that. So here we go. One for M, magnesium. Two for P, phosphorus. One for M, two for P, the third one is just a symbol. The fourth word is Kermit. You know potassium. Then you have number five, C for calcium. You have number six, H for actually HCO3, which is bicarb. You have number seven, O for oxygen. Now your little behind came in here from preschool knowing oxygen. Don't make me hurt you in Jesus' name and pray about it later. Stay with me. You got this letter C again for number eight, and that's your chloride. By the way, you don't even have to know chloride. Ain't nobody in them, and nobody I ever seen in my life, and I've been a nurse 40 years. Ain't nobody cared about no chloride. But stay with me. N for sodium. N, N, the word nine, nine labs. I know you forgot already, so I'm gonna show you another little thing which makes this worth you knowing. Here we go. Magnesium, 1.5. Phosphorus, what's phosphorus, y'all? P-O-4, I believe. Don't quote me, because I don't know, honey. I, I dropped out of high school. 2.5. Potassium. 3.5. Calcium comes a little higher. We'll say 8 plus. Bicarb, watch this, HCO3. Bicarb is, we're going to say 25 plus or minus 3. If you take three the way off, you got the whole range. Oxygen, again, you came in here from preschool knowing that this was 95 at the bottom number for normal. And then you have your C for chloride, and you have another 95. And the highest lab on the list is sodium, 135. Now, all of these have little funky ranges, right? But it helps you at least get in the neighborhood of what normals are. And if you play your cards right, you got a Jay-Z rhyme. You know I like music. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Oh, I'm sorry. Nursing school. Nursing school, fool. Here we go. Magnesium, 1.5. Phosphorus, 2.5. Potassium, 
3.5, calcium, 8, bicarb, 25, oxygen, 95, chloride, 95, sodium, 135. Y'all got it? I'm going to do it fast. 